Well, El Mirage police say they discovered kids inside a filthy house filled with roaches and feces. The conditions deplorable for anyone, let alone children. Good evening, I'm Tram, I in for Caribe Divine. And I'm Mitch Carr, in for Mark Curtis. Two women were arrested and they're now behind bars facing child abuse charges tonight. Let's get out to Team 12's Bianca Bono in the neighborhood near Dysert and Greenway in El Mirage. Bianca, how did police find out about this home? Well, guys, El Mirage police were called to this home right behind me on Wednesday night for a domestic violence issue, but they certainly were not expecting to find what they did inside. They say when they walked in, they were immediately met with a pungent smell of animal urine and feces. That's when they say they started seeing smeared feces on the tile floor and piles in the corners of the stairway, then more at the top of the stairs. They also witnessed hundreds of cockroaches plus other bugs all over the floor, walls and ceiling. Three young girls ages 7, 11 and 14 were living inside the home. So out of concern for their safety and well-being, officers arrested their mother, Connie Valenci, and their grandmother, Carmen Sanfi. News of the arrests coming as a shock to one neighbor who knows them. To be honest with you, I'm kind of surprised. Um, I have a hard time believing everything, you know, that they're saying is going on, but I mean, I've never been in the house or anything like that, but we talk all the time. She, she's, a, she's a great girl, you know, the mother. And after their arrest, the women told police they do have two dogs and five cats inside the home. In fact, if you've heard that barking, that is, I believe, one of the dogs that we've seen in the backyard there. Now, neighbors say since Wednesday, they have seen police and animal control outside of this house. DCS, in the meantime, has taken emergency custody of those three kids who are living here. For now, we're live in El Mirage, Bianca Bono, 12 News.